A welcome to one of the noisier grounds in English football. It's not the biggest, but the supporters are so passionate. Selhurst Park, the home of Crystal Palace Football Club. And Alan Smith and I, Martin Tyler, will be trying to keep our voices above the din so that you can hear our commentary. Martin Kelly. Coming up now, Crystal Palace against Wolverhampton Wanderers. A couple of exceptional talents in a really good game that we might be focusing on. Well, I think both of these players should come into this match with their confidence brimming, really, because uh, they really have played well. They've uh, led from the front. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Martin Kelly starts with Scott Dan as the centre-backs. Max Meyer plays with Andros Townsend as the wide options. Wilfried Zaha starts up top with Christian Benteke. Thank you, Selhurst Park. And here is the way Wolves are set out for this vital fixture. Well, we put it up. And what looks, Alan, very defensive, but there's flexibility, isn't there, in the side? Yeah, and I think with his shape, so much depends on the wing-backs. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. Ciao, Martino! And it is the opening goal of this match. Oh, the fans are loving that one. That's beautifully done for the goal. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Well, let's take another look at the goal. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. This might be an opportunity to get level. And it is! There's the equaliser, and that could be a turning point in the game. Yeah, the momentum must be with them now. Can they go on and win it? Well, it is really game on in this match with this equaliser. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. Boyevich. Benteke. James MacArthur. And now the shot. Into the lead they go. It's a fine, well-worked goal from the team that's looking well-oiled and looking very well-drilled. They've been the better side. They've played with great panache up to this point. And that goal really sums up the way they have been playing. Excellent. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that... Special delight at the moment. Meyer. Christian Benteke. He's going to try his luck. Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration and they've won this match, I think. Well, they all count the same, but he won't ever get an easier one. No, I don't think so, but uh, he was there, right place, right time. Let's have another peek at that goal. Trying to get the ball in behind. Zaha. Townsend! And he knocks in the goal. Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion. 
Rightly so, well in the lead. Substitution for Crystal Palace. Opportunity in a wider area. Up for grabs here. Well, that might give them a little bit more confidence. The confidence has been really dented by what we've seen prior to this goal. Just a word on the goal scorer. You have to get there to get the chance. And credit him for that. Well, I think the keeper, you know, he's entitled to ask why his defenders didn't react as quickly as the goal scorer. He'd done his bit. He'd made the initial save. Zaha. Here is Benteke. And here's the shot. And there it is, the goal. He took it with great aplomb, I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. Oh, they want to see this again, this goal. Chase. Put in from the wide area. Trying to lift it over the nearest defender and he couldn't. The fourth official is Shots on here. Space for the shot. And a goal! Oh, it's another fine goal. And uh, the keeper, who's had to pick the ball out the net, he's had a miserable time, as have the losing side here. What a wonderful volley. It's a wonderful ability to have, isn't it, to connect so sweetly. It's all about timing, that volley. Well, here's the goal again. as the referee calls a halt. As a match, it was rather one-sided, wasn't it? Because of the capacity of one team to dominate the football. Well, it was a football lesson. It was pretty humiliating for the inferior team. They just didn't get into it.